Hello and welcome to Estaire's menswear in Havant. Uh, I'm here today to tell you about tie clips and how to wear your tie clip. So um, in store we find that um, there's a couple of reasons uh, why they're popular. If I'm honest the most popular is that um, they look good. Okay so most people are wearing them especially with a plainer tie because uh, wearing a tie clip um, not that there's anything wrong with that tie but it just adds a little something extra to it. So we find that's the most main popular reason that people are using them. However, there is a practical use for it as well, and that is it stops the tie from moving around, especially if you're not wearing a waistcoat, um, because actually as the wind blows or you lean forward if you're doing things, then obviously it can flap about and that will hold it in place, which is quite good. So um, what to think about when you're looking for your tie clip. The most popular um, is the silver colors, so uh, sort of white metals, and I think it's just because they're um, a little bit more popular with you know people wearing sort of white metals and silvers and stuff with other jewellery, so it's a little bit more sort of plain uh, and subtle. The other thing to think about when you're buying your tie clip um, is the size. Make sure you get the right size. So the one that we've got here today is about two two and a half inches, um, and your tie clip should not ideally be wider than your tie. So this tie is about two and a half three inches width. If you were working with a skinny tie, so a lot slimmer, then you'd be looking for one that was about an inch to an inch and a half. Again, just making sure that it's not wider than the top. So if I just take this one off and show you the tie clip. So there you go. So most of them work the same. Uh, so this one is a clasp. So you just kind of squeeze it, pop it on and then release it and then it will hold in place. Some of them come with these little chains uh, and the little chain, um, when you're doing your shirt up, you just pop it on the button as you do it and then obviously if it does fall off it's not going anywhere and um, if you don't want the chain on to be fair these are quite well gripped so uh, sometimes I actually just um, pull those off and just have them without okay when you go to put your tie clip on um, it's where do you put it do you put it up here do you put it down there so I've seen lots of different uh, opinions on this on where it should be um, but at a stairs a general rule for us we find is a good spot is it should be if you look for the breast pocket on your jacket about an inch to two below that so for me I would go about here that might change slightly if the garments you're wearing are causing you not to be able to see the whole um, tie clip so for instance if our waistcoat was a higher cut waistcoat and the inch or two below meant that this was actually hiding behind here that wouldn't look good so I would lift that up higher it might be your jacket you're doing your jacket up and your jacket cuts across you might still want to see it so that can vary but as a general rule if I can follow the breast pocket a couple of inches down and then pop it on when you're popping your tie clip on obviously the whole point of it is that it is holding on to your shirt is that make sure that you're not just grabbing the shirt you are actually going through into the placket of the shirt so that actually it's then going to hold your tie in place so I'm just going to do that on here now so pocket about an inch or two below pop that on there okay so pop that out of the way obviously that should be attached to the shirt and then just make sure it's shirt it's tight as well and um, it's straight so take the time just to make sure you don't want to walk around all day and it's it's sitting at a at a weird angle so say like that because then it really takes the whole the whole point is to kind of bring the outfit up a little bit and then actually that makes it look less so the other thing I do when I put the tie clips on is if you put the tie clip I'm just going to open that up and pull that tie so if you pop that on and your tie is nice and tight and straight it looks great all of that sort of stuff the problem is as you move your neck neck around it's going to want to pull that tie as it pulls that tie, you're going to feel that. It's going to feel it tugging on your shirt and all of that sort of stuff. If you want to avoid that, the way to do that is when you put it in place, so if I squeeze that and open that back up again, so I'm obviously I'm free to move that, is just pop your finger behind, not too much, and just give it a little bit of a pull out, then leave it in place, it's now fixed, and then you'll notice we've actually got a little bit of give on that. And also I quite like that it gives a bit of a 3D element of the tie. Optional, you don't need to do that, but I just find then when you move your neck around, you don't have any problems with it tugging at all. So there you have it. That's your tie clip. And in our opinion, that's how you should wear your tie clip. If you like the video, do subscribe. Um, we've got lots more uh, tips uh, on our videos, on our channel and our playlists. So yeah, and we'll be back again soon. Thank you.